gamers, there has been a new world record absolutely shattered by the mad lad, a personal friend of mine, glitched. We are going to react to it today. I haven't seen any of it, but the time is absolutely insane. It's been brought down by like 18 seconds. It's it's pretty nuts. So we are gonna watch that. Are you gamers ready? How much cooler would it be if I had a green screen and then I have this behind me? And then editor me puts in like um, Goku uh, twerking. I don't know. It'd be sick. You guys see it? Are, is this a good angle? Are, are you good? Wow, whoa! Dude, look at him go! Oh my gosh, how does he do it? No way, he did the skip! He did the skip! No! How? Oh, looks good. DN? <laughs> What's DN? <laughs> What's DN? <laughs> T's not. <laughs> <laughs> Let us watch the brand new Dragon Ball Z Budokai world record by Glitched in 28 minutes and I think 11 seconds for the retime. This run is also done on the Japanese version. Quite something. I mean, I've, saw, I've seen crackheads come in in the fucking early morning. Okay. Crackheads. In the early morning. Love to see it. I'm watching 720, we're not broke bitches. Uh, Let's see what we got here. <clears throat> I didn't even know- oh. Chat is... Covering the splits. It was like a hookah. It was like a hookah that got like- It was like- Modified. Good luck on the run. Yeah, let me just- let me just act like it's me. Really quick. Skipping these cutscenes. Well, I guess they did smoke. Yeah, they did smoke. Skipping these cutscenes. Yep. Let's go. But I, I mean, well, no, what was it? Fucking, what's his name? Let's snort it. Tuko? Maybe no. everyone will come in. Yeah. Crazy motherfucker. <laughs> oh, like, block on the first frame, dude. Yeah. Tragic. Of course, this guy gets yeah. perfect. Oh, and the fast get up. I mean, perfect, perfect cancels. What do you expect? I'm surprised you waited on that Kamehameha. I think you just, I feel like you would just let it go, but maybe it's faster. I know sometimes it's faster to just not Kamehameha. 106, that's pretty standard. Pretty standard stuff. <laughs> having a 104 is basically having a gold. It's it's extremely good to have that. So 106 isn't too bad. I wish they would have just what was it? Walter was just out of his scope. Right? Fast wake up, if only. Yeah, I never get those. But yeah, this run's done on the Japanese version, to my knowledge. Well, to all of our knowledge. Uh, it's not faster in any way. At least it doesn't. It doesn't appear that way. So we'll see. Uh, we'll see how it goes. He wanted to be the boss, so he had to kill the boss. But being the boss of all that comes with a lot of bullshit. I'm not stealing runs. At we're reacting. Fucking skinheads. It's only faster to not Kamehameha if you're in Namek. Yeah, I, I, if if you have anything past like Kaioken times ten, you pretty much don't want to Kamehameha anymore. If you can't help it, or if you can help it, you don't want to Kamehameha. Also, uh, good good uh, Raditz mini game. I always freaking lose on that one over and over and over again. It's not stealing content. Stop. <laughs> I am doing justice to the community. I'm bringing light to these runs. I am making you. Oh, missed it. Good recovery, though. Got up really fast. Hey, yo. Ain't no way you still get a 307 with that. Huh? Kill your whole 
What? I am the community. Look, I'm just bringing light to these games and showing how absolutely pog champ you all are at it. So, a simple thank you would, will suffice instead of uh, stealing. All right. We're a little sus. See, at first, everybody it is a little bit of a sus run. I mean, Sorry. Yeah. I like how they work that New Vegeta tech like here. Really Boom. Miss intentionally misses those forward that forward kick. Tragic. That's really nice. Wow. Man, I should have been supporting Hank the whole time. Hank was the fucking homie. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Vegeta's hitbox like, is so good absolutely cracked in this game as well as that when you do certain attacks from the back plus, on Vegeta, they just miss. They just completely whiff. Yeah. And so, uh, <laughs> yeah, he figured out video. that if you yeah, just do it really fast, you'll miss. So it intentionally... It'll, it'll intentionally... Uh, hang on, let me get to a better screen. There we go. It'll intentionally miss the person, and then it will drop the combo, so it'll reset the damage, because each hit in this game will do significantly less each time. So every time you miss that and reset it, you're going to do full damage again. It's a it's actually really brilliant. Wait, you doing that? No. I'm just making stuff up. Just adapt, so true. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> yeah, this is the most skillful split in the entire game. Like, if you want to know pure RNG in a speedrun, it's this right now. This whole this whole fight, we spam square. It's the fastest way. You spam square and hope Vegeta will not block or attack. That's it. It's insane how trash that is. <laughs> so <laughs> latent talent and raw skill, yeah. yeah. Fucking, I, like I do believe if you can mash fast him. enough, you can you can um have less of a chance that Vegeta's gonna uh, blow your back out. I am convinced if you can mash fast enough, you have better luck. Uh, it it might just be me huffing a bunch of copium, but I truly believe it's the case. So I truly do. <laughs> Saul's my. Better if you always attacked but got counter hit every time for maximal I, damage. Yeah, yeah, but you have to like attack faster than his attack. So like the counter hit still goes into play, but Vegeta won't like fall over. It's so weird. I grinded so hard that I was like, fuck, I It's so goofy. I also believe if this game actually had load times like a real console 28 minutes would actually be like 18 minutes i swear ps2 is so slow sometimes it just, it's really tragic like we just watch this radar spin around forever good start oh this is nice only one fall over yeah holy moly that's so tough Gosh, like the spacing alone is so finicky with Vegeta there. You have to be a certain distance. That's why he backsteps. You have to be a certain distance away to get... <laughs> you have to be a certain distance to get that volley because as soon as you volley all the key blasts, it ends. So that's the, that's the key. It's like 85 spacing and whatever hex code that they have it's just the dumbest thing ever man space is so tragic all of it is is just like such a big run killer like this one in particular how many times like vegeta with his broken hitbox is going to do the wrong charge attack like that and wastes time this is pretty good though this is quick. 654 training one. I have never gotten a sub 7 in my life. The lowest I've gotten is a 704. That's actually insane. It's worth 
It just takes a while to get it. Well, it gets going. Actually insane. There's a reason that there's a bizarre in the name as I as it comes it gets bizarre. That training two is okay. That's only in the English version of the name. In Japan it's just JoJo's Venture. Just JoJo's, yeah. It just, I'm glad and then uh Vegeta 3 the last space. You only have one health bar. Makes, makes it's really easy in any percent. If you play this game on the hardest difficulty, this fight is extremely hard. Because you have no health. It's horrible. Oh no, not the turnaround. Six hits. See, like, that's a 54. I think my fastest Vegeta is like a 55, 56. Actually, kind of wild. You gotta, now's the best time because they just finished part. Vegeta 3 is one of the hardest, yeah. I think the only one that's harder is um, uh, Team Gohan with Cell Juniors. Yeah, it is the reboot. It's the end of it. Because Goku actually has good combos. A lot of people say, oh, part four is the best part. <laughs> yeah. yeah, the Japanese version has Goku popping off every time you uh, do combo cancels. It's pretty wild. I just like the characters in that one. They're all sick. The story's good. And then part five, I just like because Italian. I like the Italian. Part five JoJo does go hard. Does go hard. Base take by uh, Starstorm. Alright, we're at the start of Namek, so this is the middle of the run, so. Mid run, sub 19, that's real, or sub 9, that is really good. Oh my gosh, that Ginyu is also beautiful. Or not Ginyu, uh, Raccoon. That's wild. Oh, I forgot she does Taekwondo. Yeah, the three-ish that JoJo insane. characters that are and Street Fighter characters that are like at this point, I'm already like feeling a little bit of a little bit of something. Like nerves come and go, and like when you start getting the top runner. But at this yeah, point, like when you see that pace, you kind of get like a little oh no, it's a little bit of a pacer. You're not quite attached yet, but you're feeling you're feeling a little something. So that's why I love that this is just a casual world record. Like he's just hanging out with the boys in call, and he's like, yeah, I'm just gonna just gonna do a couple runs. Yeah, just gonna have a little fun, and then absolutely pops off in the biggest world record I've seen. Let's see if he gets the Ginyu block right here. Yup. Every time, man. Seven hits, take it though. Kick. Yep. That's pretty nice too. Hammer fisted his behind. Yo. Chokes you out. I don't. I fucking love <laughs> Makoto, dude. She's so. She, cause she, she's a kid. Oh, of this. okay. I remember yeah. That. yeah. I love her. This Ginyu too. His best time's a 103. I don't even know what mine is. Big aggressive rushdown character. Yeah, she's have... a counter poke character. Like, what? are you listening to music? Oh, yeah, you just... There's this Japanese... Or is that on my end? Wait. That's really good. You are. What the. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, if I can't if I can't upload this now, I'm about to be pissed. Nice. Oof. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. Goofy Aa ah, Ginyu. Like what was that time? I totally I had it. 105? That's still pretty good. Like a huge ass fucking... That's insane. Page. Books. Like, like, using that new strat uh, that we found of doing a forward kick punch like still speeds up that fight by that much, even with, like, sus. It's pretty crazy. That's sad. There's no game music? That's, yeah. It's okay, my brother. I didn't even notice. Is that faster? Alex is bad. Yeah, but he's not very good. He's not good in that one. In, in SoundCloud? Yeah. 
I think, uh, shit, I wish they, I don't think they put Makoto back in there. Hmm. I wish they would have put Makoto in five, and then I would be playing it more. But I probably, I mean, I was playing Karen. So minus 19. Karen. You have to have kept this pace for the rest of the run. <laughs> I just really like, uh, it makes me curious because was. Gosh, if only I could ever get a Frieza like that. My Frieza one is it's so tough. That fight is so hard because Frieza also has a weird hitbox, right? Where if you just if you just don't hit Frieza properly, it, it's just gonna ruin the whole fight and you're gonna lose 15 seconds. It happens every time. Yeah. It's still a thing, so I have to start running this game with no music. Oh, I didn't even know that. I'm learning. Is that what's stopping me from having world record? Yeah, it kind of did. Some sort of thing, because that's like a popular. That's like a laugh they use in a lot of stuff now. Yeah, devil, devil. Minus twenty. When you already have world record is insanity. It's just all insanity. I forget what else they fucking had. Budokai 2 OST? That's actually not a bad idea. That game was just bad. Just make a playlist. I just did not like it. The backstep. So classic Frieza fashion. This fight also sucks. Being in the air makes the hitbox even worse. It's because of the sidestep. I'll, let's see if you'll see it. Right here. Boom. If you're not fast enough, I don't know what it is. It's like if you're not fast enough. In your reset, the the you're like the game doesn't think that you've sidestepped far enough to turn around or to be behind Frieza. So Frieza will just like automatically turn around. It's the worst thing ever. It's actually the worst thing ever. Because they because for some reason these fights they put you in the air to start. They don't put you on the ground. So it just it makes the hitbox weird. It makes the movement weird. Like you don't move quite as far. It's 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 pretty trash. I like air because it's cool. Oh, good get up there. No block. Yeah, dude, Super Saiyan is so powerful in this game. Oh no, the one HP! Oh, that sucks. Just because Q's just got a fucking cool ass. Just a mysterious character. I really wish they would have put Q in. Oh, fucking. Mad Critch. And like, whenever he beats you in third strike, after he looks down on you and he like, like he's sad, and then he just stomps on your head. Hmm. <laughs> I'm like Jesus Christ! He's like he's a mon he's like a he even says I think he's a monster. You can barely make it out with his voice because it's like distorted. But you can I have no it. idea what y'all are talking about. I honestly have no clue. So it makes Who, think Sub geez. sixteen, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Namek. That's actually he's insane. I think my lowest I've ever been out of Namek is like his story is very sixteen thirty or something. I swear. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, it was some sort of a, yeah, some sort of <laughs> It's like what, 10 or 15% in Budokai 2 and 3 like as opposed to 40? Yeah, so Budokai 2 and 3, Super Saiyan is 10% in uh, this one, Goku's is 40 because he has 5 Kaiokens. His Kaioken time, or he has 3, I'm sorry. His Kaioken times 2, times 5, and times 10 in this game. So being Super Saiyan because it takes 5 key bars is 40% damage increase. It's just stupid. 6 hits. Wow. Baited him with the movement. That is so good. Really nice Android 19. Two fists clenched I took off my headset after yeah, Android 19. Yeah. yeah like so this is the run killer. This is like the wall. Like for for like if you've never done a speed run of Budokai or have like always been interested, Piccolo is 
literally D tier character. Absolutely trash in this game. So this is your wall. Because not only do you have one Piccolo fight against a really hard opponent, we have two. You have two. So, this is like, nothing matters up until this point, to be honest. Because you're easily going to lose 20 seconds here if you, like, miss one combo. It's horrible. So, you just... It means that if you want to play Q well, a lot of Q players that are really, really good, the discerning factor is that they're like blocking. High I'm really curious how well this is going to go because you're already on pace. Yeah. Oof. Okay, but you know what? You got the last hit. That's all that matters with Piccolo. Little turnaround, who cares? You're getting damage. Hits both. That using final destruction. Yup. Finish it. Oof. Nice. Good hits. Yeah, that's crazy. Look at that. Minus nine. Already back in it. Incredible. Yeah, like the reason why Piccolo is so bad is because that, that beginning starter, there's four kicks. And after the second kick, it actually takes so long to get the third kick out again that the AI will block. And so you actually don't even want your first two uh, kicks to hit. You want your last two. I mean, really, you want them all. But like, if anything, you want your last two kicks to hit so you can sidestep and get behind and do more damage. Otherwise, you're 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 gonna be stuck in a blocking loop and it's you're gonna actually cry. It's it's one of the worst things ever. So that's a beautiful start. But like I said, you're not out of the woods because now you got this guy, this handsome young lad. Great start though. Nine hits though. That sucks. That did 200 points of damage. Also really sad. Oh, 17. Oh, in the block. Oh, no. Okay. Still saved time, though. That's... That's... It's pretty intense. That's pretty intense. It did 300. It looks like not like that. I play them based off a little bit of hybrid. I need them to have my like flavor in their body, or I can't. Like, Worth it to do like grenade? Ah, I don't know. I feel like at this point with RNG and how grinded this is, it's just better to just pray and hope you're gonna get all your stuff right. Submit this is yours. This has already been submitted. I'm actually watching this from the leaderboard. So. Not like Leo and Guilty Gear Unga necessarily. Interesting. But I mean it's hot. I don't even know I don't even know what the combo is for light grenade. It's like punch punch back punch or something. Or punch forward punch. This fight is so deceptively hard. Or deceptively easy, I should say. Wow, what a start. Oh my dude, that's so good. Oh, that's so good. The hard part is like, it's so easy to get your first combo, but after that, it's sell. So like, you're either gonna get blocked or you're gonna get womboed. And to get that perfectly like that is just absolutely insane. But here's the start of the end. This is the start of your end game with the worst character in the entire game. It's this is awful. Like you want to talk about like how speedrunning is like it's just like incredibly hard end game when it comes to anime bosses. This is it. It's so it's it's so tough. Most depressing split incoming. This killed the twenty seven. All right, let's see what happens. Good start. Four hits. Ooh, got another up. Oh, there's the blast. Block. Okay, still getting some damage off. Oof. Oh, no. Dang. Really evil looking character on Jumper for some reason. I was really into that. And then 
Oh! One HP in a dream, dudes. Oh! No. Oh, that sucks. That's... Oh, that's hard. I was gonna say, I was like, this actually isn't that bad. Like, yeah, you got beat a couple times, but... You could still only lose, like, plus five. But there, there's that the end. Aggro, aggro 1 HP range. That's tough, man. That's so tough. Still minus 16, though. I'm... Unreal. I gotta look at... I, there's so many blades in here. I can't remember all of the ones. Yeah, this... Yeah, I... The, the cell arena is so broken because you have a weird standing animation on the stairs. And so it, like, changes your hitbox range when you do combos. And it messes with heights when you launch them. It messes with spacing when you want to attack. So, like, when the Cell Juniors are, like, on the stairs and you try to punch, like, one of your punches will whiff and then they have one HP at the end. And then you have to lose, like, a quarter of a second. It's so weird. Let's see how this goes. This is also one of these fights that's, like, deceptively easy. Because you do four punches, like, in Vegeta 1. See, there's the stairs. Already changed it. But you do a you do a very very small micro walk forward is what we call it, where you tap and you move to get right in range to to punch again. Yeah, see how like you you'll miss. It's it's weird if you don't like do that movement. Ouch. These aren't too bad so far. You've had two bumps. It's pretty much all you want, though. You can minimize that. <laughs> the forward PK. I can tell this man's angry. Gold! Wait, what was your split time there? A 214? I don't even know what mine is. This is like literally my aesthetic, so. Hey, me and Glitch were fucking wiped. 214? I actually want to know <laughs> what mine is. I know, I don't know if he's, wait, Glitch, wait, he's gone. But, uh, fucking I'm look right now. No, he's still here, but fucking, we only played. Pico, what is my gold? I mean, I Sona, my gold sell juniors. My gold cell juniors is a 215.8. What did he have? A 214? We were like That's 16. wild. We didn't get, I mean, we played hella league, but we had to buy the loot. We were fucking wiping time. Oh, didn't catch fully. Just to drop this, because that way, like, I don't Rough start. Good combo. Uh, the discrepancy between poison uh, has been addressed more than once with former and current Capcom employees. Final fight designer Arika found Good catch. That timing is so weird. Nice. Wow, plus six? That's a hard sell to go against, man. That's crazy. That's a pr that, that is a good sell. Like. Like, that's not even bad, to be honest. And to have plus six, that's hard. That is insanity. Um, yeah, that's like another reason why these cell fights are so hard with Gohan is because he literally has no moves. So you want to do a, a forward punch and a kick to lift cell off of the ground. And I call it feathering. I don't know what everyone else calls it, like a buffer, I guess. But you want to do two punches and then have a have a quick input buffer yeah, well, I know it was and then do four more so you can get more damage off because cell is just so brutal and you just cannot have any um like time to do anything because he'll just absolutely just go fricko mode on your face that we just try to get all the damage in the air it's like the only way if you tass it, there is a way to do one combo on the ground, but it's literally like frame perfect. It's it, we, we won't do it. It's too it's too hard. It really bugs me when poison cross rushes everywhere. 
uh, and like stuff like that. So there's in the Japanese version they keep referring to. Uh, All right, final one. Let's see. This is only minus twelve. But in the English release, they're nice. Really oh, three in a row. He's insane. So it is kind of funny, but they've, they've since just like immediate one though. That, like went fully on it. <laughs> ah. I think it's just like a big company thing where. I think they wow. were specifically just committed. Uh, if it wasn't, I just like, got a supremely about. cracked PB in Budokai. Oh, <laughs> <just worked. laughs> that's how it ends. Supremely cracked. <laughs> Yo, the pop off at the end. That's so crazy. GG glitched. Super good run. Absolutely killed it. Um, just consistent all the way through is, is really how it is. Just consistent as can be. And um, congrats on that. And let's see if that world record stays. I think it's going to stay for a while. That's a really good run.